my channel. So I recently got the car of my dreams. So I thought I would give you guys a little bit of a car tour, if you will. <laughs> Ever since I was really little, I've always wanted a Volkswagen Beetle, but I had my parents' old Ford Explorer. It just finally died on me, so I was forced to get a new car. And everyone said, don't get a Beetle, don't do it, you'll regret it. If you drive an SUV all this time, like you'll never get used to driving such a tiny car. But I thought, if I have to buy a car, I'm gonna buy exactly what I want. So it's a Volkswagen Beetle Turbo, which honestly, those are just words to me. I don't know anything about cars. So when I went to test drive a Beetle, I was expecting it to be a lot different than since I did have an SUV before but it actually drives really nice and it wasn't very hard to get used to. So here, let me show you. Here is my steering wheel I'm at my parents' house right now. So my car before was a 2004 Ford Explorer, so it had no cool features. So this car is like, like incredible compared, like I know like a Beetle is not everyone's dream car, but for me it is and it's super comfortable to drive. It has like heated seats and I can like listen to Spotify on it. So let me start it and I can show you some of the features. So it has like this screen here where it has all different buttons. It connects to my phone with Bluetooth which is really cool too. Like this stuff just blows my mind. I have never, um, I've just never had anything like this. Built-in navigation. This has the backup camera and there's like a thing for your phone so you can like speed dial. You can use Bluetooth to listen through your phone which is awesome. But my favorite part about this car, hands down, is the seats. So it has gingham seats. I don't know if, it, if you can see it in the video. I hope you can though. But it's like brown and gingham. So it's like, like Dorothy from Wizard of Oz. So of course I named my car Dorothy. Might be weird to name your car, but my last car's name was Clifford. And this is Dorothy. And she's really nice and really cute. The only thing I have in this car right now is like an umbrella in case it rains really bad. And my tea mugs that I bring to work. She has lights that you have to turn on like this. That's been the biggest adjustment is to like remember to turn my lights on um, because my old car had it automatically, so that's like the only downside. But it, it'll like come up on the screen telling you like, turn off your lights and like don't forget your cell phone so you can never forget your cell phone or to turn off the lights because she's so friendly and will remind you. And there's a little thing for speed warning so she will let you know if you're going too fast. And the back seat just looks so cozy. I have not had friends back there yet. And I can show you the trunk too. And the back seats actually lay down so you can make the trunk even bigger. It's super cool. Let me show you. I don't know why, like I feel like this is super like secret high tech. You push in the logo and then you pull it up. And then there's the trunk, and like I said, the seats lay down. So in the event that me and Gerald were gonna need to put some band equipment back here if we were playing a show, we could totally do that too because we can lay those down and fit our guitars perfectly. So it's like a tiny car with good gas mileage, but we can still use it for shows. As long as there's only two of us. If it was gonna be more than two, it might be a little difficult. But yeah, this is my dream car. When I was in elementary school, I told one of my friends that when I'm 16, I want to get a beetle. I originally wanted a yellow beetle, but she told me that they look childish and I'll change my mind. So I just, I always think about that ever since I bought this car and I'm like, I wish she could see me now. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you liked my little car tour. Let me know your dream car in the comments below. Thanks for watching!